Uh, I mean, there's a lot of things I can I can say on that list of what I like about the team. Is we just got a, a great group of players that are bought into what we're trying to accomplish as a group. And they're very unselfish, sometimes too, un too unselfish. And, um, you know, they, they trust each other, they play hard for each other, and, you know, they want to win. So it's, it's easy as a coach to come in every day and practice and everybody's working towards the same goal and not really worrying about who gets the credit and things like that. And um, so it makes my job a whole lot easier. And so, and that stuff is, winning is a byproduct of all that stuff. You know, one thing that I'm always going to talk about is we always say like win anyway. And, you know, what that really means is not like a win at all cost thing. It's more of, hey, we're going to go on the road. We're not going to play our best basketball or we're going to miss some free throws. We're going to miss some layups. We're going to cause some turnovers. Let's win the game anyway. And so like just a kind of a next play mentality type thing. And it's even when <clears throat> we talk about just in, in life in general, hey, you're going to have a test that we're going to get back from Center College at three o'clock in the morning. You got a test on Monday. You got to make an A anyway. You know, we're going to go on the road and the officials are not going to be great. We're going to win the game anyway. It's stuff like that. So, you know, we can get them to kind of not make excuses and, and, and those types of things. And we can just move on to the next play and just play our best basketball and, and, and give everything we got for 40 minutes out there. Then we should come out ahead. I would say obviously Haley is always doing what we need her to do and is always really reliable and pretty consistent. Um, Elise is stepping up like crazy, which we expected seeing her freshman year and how well she did and now she's just continuing to do that. Uh, and definitely Garen coming in as a freshman and really helping us out is much appreciated and I'm really excited to see what she can do. Individually, I would say like maintaining composure and keeping my team together and really holding that captain position, that point guard spot, like and taking that seriously. Um, that's a little bit difficult, especially when the games get a little stressful at times and everybody's screaming and that I would say maintaining my composure. We've always been really good on the defensive side of things and staying connected and Playing through runs is really important to us and definitely being able to communicate. Um, I think we're going to do great things. I'm really excited. It's going to be so much fun, especially how well we play together on the defensive side of things. And I think offense definitely comes from how well we do on defense. When I make a mistake, the first thing I do is look at Coach Blanc and like try and gauge how serious it is. Um, and He's been with me for the last three years, definitely keeping me accountable and, but also kind of bringing me back down to earth. And I really appreciate that, being able to rely on my coach like that. Um, and this year I would say our bench is doing an amazing job of keeping us all in the game when we have to play through runs and stuff like that. So I would say looking at my teammates when there's a lot of pressure and knowing that they have confidence in me to do what I need to do. It's, you know, winning, winning a championship is hard. Um, and it's something that I've talked about since, since day one here. And, you know, trying to explain that to new players and even, even to our returners and all as well. Winning games at any level is hard. There's so much that goes into a, a single basketball game um, from a prep work and practice and scouting and preparation and all this stuff. And then to win games on the road is even harder. Um, you know, there our two closest games this year were teams that are, you know, at the, the bottom half of the conference. And, but winning games on the road with the travel and to be mentally tough enough to come out of those games to, to, to win is, is something that's hard. So any team that goes 12 and two like, and, and win an outright championships, a special group that shows how mentally tough they are, physically tough they are. And some things gotta go our way, right? We gotta get lucky a little bit and we gotta stay healthy and, the ball got to bounce our way. I'm, I'm certainly not, you know, tone deaf when it comes to like, hey, I've been a part of some teams that I thought had a really good chance to win a championship and finish middle of the pack. And I've been a part of some teams that I was like, all right, I hope we finish middle of the pack and come out on top, you know? So it, it, it is hit and miss sometimes, but certainly you got to play hard. You got to come together. You got to trust each other and trust what our, our, our initial goal is of winning a championship.